Hello everyone, and welcome to a game called Truss. I don't know what it's about, and it opened up as soon as I started it, and this is all we see. Some kind of pole. Oh. Pick up the vessel. Click to interact. Oh, it's a furnace. I don't know what it looked like before. Give it your flame. Hold R to wake. Wait, I didn't put the log in. Okay. Give it your flame. Place it in the throne. Whoa. A warm, dimly lit flame burns quietly in my dom domicile? Is that how you pronounce that? This looks nice. Let's go ahead and close that. <clears throat> Oh my goodness, the fucking textures are, like, super trippy. I feel like I'm more awake than I've ever been. Really. Oh my gosh, look at that. Alright. Looks like we're in a cute little house. Peering through the window, peering through the shutters, I can glimpse the grace of snow. It's nights like these I find myself the most comfortable. I agree. Perhaps it's the silence of it all, or the act of preserving heat in the cold. Alright, well, let's go outside. Shift to run. Obviously, that's in most games like that. Oh. Oh! That's cool. I actually like, make tracks in the snow. That's a really weird looking tree. Tonight, all of your demons will join you. Huh? I just heard something by the nature of that trail sign. Yeah, there's definitely something over here. <clears throat> what is that? Come here. Nature trail. Where are you going? Get back here. Okay, I don't think I can catch up with it. The music's getting louder. Come on, I'm almost there. Come on. Oh, what is this? Telephone pole? <clears throat> Why am I following this thing out into the woods? Ooh, the music's getting real loud. This does look pretty nice, though. Just stopped. They're gone. Have you lost yourself? Hold R to wake. Oh, what is that? Oh, I thought that was a dead body or something through there. What a bizarre sign. I've lost myself. All right, time to wake up. Trust. Interesting. The flame continues to burn. So, what was the point of that? Okay. Can't shake the feeling that the silence of this night is an omen. Alright, well, time to go back outside. Oh. I think I just heard more footsteps. What is that? Causeway. Well, let's go ahead and follow these lights. I like how they, they have their own sound, kind of like a soundtrack. That's nice. Well, so far it's not very scary. But that could change. Oh, I see, it looks like, oh, I think it's my house. It looks like eyeballs in the distance. <clears throat> All right, so where does this mysterious trail of lights in my woods lead me to. Soundtrack in this game is very immaculate. Okay, that's got a lot of wires going to it. Oh, what the fuck is that? Whoa, whoa, what? Wait. Huh? 
Wait, hold on. Okay, whoa, whoa, I just lost myself. Is this like a teleporter? Okay, fuck, I didn't mean to walk into it. Damn it. Okay, I think it's like a teleporter or something. That's super weird. Okay, here's another one. Why, though? You're getting bigger. Alright, this is the end of the road. It was a really big one. Still goes right back to the beginning, though. I wonder what happens if I just walk out into the woods. Um, I guess I'm gonna go through this. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, what is happening? I, I can't see anything. Whoa, this is so cool. Holy shit. It's like building my house over and over again. What are these? What in the world? It's very pretty so far. Okay, we got like three fires. Let's go for the red one. I feel like that's what our fire looks like, so why not? Whoa. Okay, we got an up arrow. The king. Yeah? Okay. Up arrow with two triangles. That's the damned. And we got an arrow. The melancholy, I think it's what that said. Whoa. Whoa. The dream. What in the world? How did I get back here? Oh, let's go inside. Let's get out of the cold. Anything in here? Flame grows stronger. Does it now? As if it's anxious to escape. Starting to doubt if the quality of sleep I'm getting from this. Um, there's not really much to do in here. There's this weird like red carpet on the ground, but I should check the stove. What well, I just did. Flame grows stronger. Should check the stove. What? What stove? There's only one stove in here, and it's it's looking good. Burns with a passion that is something to be reckoned with. Oh. Hello. What is that? <laughs> this is a spaghetti monster. Uh, why is my vision going black? We can't stay here forever. Our flame needs to breathe. Uh, what? Where am I? Yeah, my exact reaction. Well, let's go to these lights, I guess. So far, this is really weird. It's like... It's a really artistic, pretty horror game. I do not like how open this is. There's no trees, right? Oh, here we go. This is where you get slaughtered by Bigfoot Man. Because you're hanging out in the middle of the woods. Okay, here's this again. Am I gonna get more boxes that teleport me? Mm, maybe not. Oh, had a burp coming, but it went away. I have no idea what to do. What is with these lights? Oh, wait, what is that? Is that always there? Something over there. I don't think I saw it before. I 
feel like my footsteps are getting louder. What the heck is that? Okay, that's just the first light, I think. I don't know, maybe not. No, this is different. Huh. So, what now? Do I just walk in the woods? I don't really see anything. Seems like a very, very bad idea, but I guess I can do it. <clears throat> Nothing like a peaceful walk in the woods. I really don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, maybe I was supposed to wake. Okay, wait, hold on. Yeah, that, that oh, I'm stupid. Oh my gosh, my house is burning down. Burns. Yeah, what is going on? Whoa, whoa, what is that? I can't wake up. That's different. It won't budge. I can't see it. Whoa! Okay, I'm going to the matrix. Oh my goodness, what is that? My house is... is like de-atomizing. Oh, I can jump... jump out of it. Okay, what are you? I don't know, but I'm going to follow it, apparently. Oh, I'm back. It's gone. Should I put more wood? No. Feels like it's not here. What's not here? Oh, this is dark. Can't wake up either. Oh, no, I can wake up. It's gone. <laughs> okay, I can keep my eyes shut. I can actually move, too. wonder if this is something. Yeah, probably not. I can't see anything. Go out, we go out in the woods. Goodbye, house. Here's these again. What is in the sky? I just walked through that. Um, I hear something. Hold on. Where is that? Maybe I have to follow that noise. Oh, oh. Uh, something is forming over here. What was that? It's only when I look over here. What the heck is going on in this game? Seems to be just be following these telephone wires and it's getting more and more fucky. Sound design in this game is really good. What does that say? I, uh, can't feel anything, it hurts. Cannot feel anything. Oh, it's getting like the snow's on top of me now. sleep okay it puts me back here but like I'm not supposed to do that hmm. oh I didn't go far enough whoops it's my bad what the hell is that, my house?
Oh, my goodness. There's no comfort to be found here. My flame has abandoned me. Why? Oh, what is that? Another note. I can't feel anything. Huh. Okay. I think I'm beginning to understand what's happening. Well, I'm not, so please elaborate. Share with the class. It's been burning my soul. This crushing, awful realization. This world is not what it seems. This world is one I've manufactured. And this life I'm living, fabricated with it. A life so full of agency and freedom. That it leaves a void which generally terrifies me. Genuinely, sorry. And no matter how stubborn I am, how much I want to live this life. I cannot feel anything from it. I cannot cope. You know, I feel you, brother. Life is so expansive, so open-ended. It's hard to... hard to cope with that level of freedom sometimes. What is that? It looks like a llama. Oh my gosh. I am the chess piece. What is that? It's me! Oh, I got eyeballs! That's kind of interesting. So... It's always been me. The only demon of this world. Eternal servant to my flame. To thy flame. Whoa. Okay, I got a circle around my face now. What's that mean? Oh, I can close my eyes. Sorry. My flame did ne never did leave me. It <laughs> did never leave me. I don't need to escape. I don't need to leave behind what makes me who I am. I'm ready to recollect my flame. Are you? Let's get it. Okay, what did that do? I recollected thy flame. Hey, I could I can feel something. Oh. I'm sorry to have deceived us both. I really thought I needed this. I thought I needed to escape. Everyone I've ever known and created always seems so fulfilled. Living their own stories, living for themselves and their world. Never concerned with any th with authoring realities outside of their own. I always assumed that I would start my own story as soon as I satisfied my flame. Yet, after an eternity of creating, I realize that day may ne that day may never come. What the heck? Oh, here's the giant teleporting triangle, or rectangle again. Ooh, this is better. What is this? I abandoned my flame into a vessel, manifesting this reality to be unburdened by its needs. I left all of my memories behind and assumed my artificial role. I told myself I'd, I've always been there, here, and that my demons were never a part of me. I think I did that because I believed my eternal pursuit of art was a curse, that I would never get to escape it and finally have my own story. But I realized that an eternal life of passions and the endless pursuit of art is still a story worth having. You know, that's sweet. What is that? Oh, it's, it's me again? I should never have blamed the flame. <laughs> it always been it was it's always been there for me. 
It's always been a p part of me. It's always been my seed of purpose. And even if I'll never satisfy it, it makes me happy to try. To create things that never were. To create things that never will. To create with all that, that encompass me. This just sounds like, uh... The life of a creator, you know? Putting their lives into games and art. I'm glad I got to share this world with you. I hope to meet you again someday, and we'll share what we both made. Until then, I'm ready to wake up now. Time to wake up. Okay, well, I woke up and the game crashed. <laughs> so, um, that was... Truss. Um... An interesting horror game, to say the least. Uh, it was more like an experience, I would say, than a horror game. But interesting, you know? And it kind of delves into what at least I got from it. Um, the life of a creator and putting their lives into creating these worlds and games. And sort of leaving their demons at the door, you know? Their, their, their troubles and lives in their lives. Leaving them at the door... To create these worlds that are free of them. I think that's kind of what it's getting at. I don't know. I could be wrong. Maybe I'm just saying bullshit. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Um, I enjoyed playing this game. And check out my other indie games that I've played in the past. And I'll see you all in the next one.